Okay, so I'm going to attempt to do an outfit of the day on a cruise. It's my first cruise. It's my first video like this. I've never hardly even done any videos and I've never done any outfits of the day, but I thought it would be fun. I found it really interesting when I was watching others when I was trying to get ready for the cruise, so I, would, I just thought I would do my own. Um, so you're going to just see day one through day seven, and you're going to see outfit changes, you know, daytime, and then there's going to be nighttime, an elegant night, that kind of thing, uh, excursions. So different outfits, different days. So if that interests you, just keep watching. So we're at day one. You just saw me a second ago, and now you're seeing the full outfit. The full outfit is a two-piece. It comes with a high-waisted skirt that zips up the back, and it's a set, so it's got a little crop top that comes with it, and it's got an upside-down V, which I think is super flattering, and little ruffled detail on the shoulders and even on the trim at the bottom. And because it was uh, the day that we get on, we have all that luggage that we drag around, I wore flats, so little sandals. Much better than heels much more comfy. So this is day one, outfit one, and I will come back if I end up changing for dinner. All right, it is day two. This is my daytime outfit. It's just like a really lightweight top with some white shorts. This is uh, one of the boutique shirts that I sell on Poshmark. It's uh, off the shoulder, or you can take these straps and tie it around your neck. Has bell sleeves. And this is really pretty, like sky blue color. And this is what the back looks like. I paired it with uh, American Eagle shorts from last season. They have these really cute pocket details, lace, crochet, whatever you want to say. And I uh, paired all the whole outfit with just some flat sandals from American Eagle because I like to be comfy. But this is a closer look at the top and the shorts. And you may be able to find this pair of shorts on um, Poshmark. They're called the American Eagle Shorty. So you might want to give that a search. And I paired it with this bag here, which is actually from Target like two seasons ago. I just love the fringe on this, and it's really good for pretty much any season. And it is windy out, so I am wearing my hair up. And that is outfit number one for day two. Okay, so I'm back. It's still day two and it's elegant night. So here's the dress for that. It's a coral, like really bright Gianni Benny maxi dress. It doesn't show up that bright on camera, but it's a super neonish color that looks really good against a tan. It has a partial lining here and it's full length. And I have paired it with my wedge guess heels and to give you well I can't really give you a full length let me try here give you the whole picture here so that's from top to bottom so that is day two not time out yet all right so it is day three I'm gonna be at the pool most of the day so I am just wearing a bikini and this little cover-up and the sunglasses, I actually got the sunglasses off of Amazon. I will try to link these below. Um, the bathing suit cover up is just really cro cute crochet um, material with tassels on the side. And I just love the, the cut of it, it's super cute. I actually sell this in my Poshmark boutique. Uh, it's a one size fits all. I can try to link that below too. And other than that, I just paired all this with my waterproof Steve Madden bag. Got this at Ross's like last week. So they may have some at your local Ross's and there's pockets all inside and then a little wallet for anything super important. Best thing is it's waterproof. So yeah, this is day three's outfit. Okay, I'm back with t Knot's outfit. It is not three. And it's 80s night, so I put on a jumpsuit. That's about the closest thing I have to 80s attire, maybe closer to 70s. It has a wide leg. The brand is She's Sky, and this is a size medium, and it ties right here. I put a pair of earrings from Target that I got a couple of seasons ago with it. 
I attempted the big hair, did not work out, so it just kind of went up. Um, I wore my Guess Wedge heeled sandals with it and paired the Steve Madden bag I found this season from Target. Just a little small black bag with inside pockets and an outside pocket here. And that is it. That is tonight's outfit. Alright, so it's a real quick video today about to go on an excursion in Jamaica. Um, so I just have the high rise shorty shorts in a size 6 from Express on. I just put them over my high waisted bikini bottoms and then this little crop top. I don't remember the brand but I will try to link it down below. It's like some sort of the H, H-Y-V-E maybe. Um, but yeah, it just ties in the back like this and just wear it over over your bathing suit and I just have my like, I don't know, three year old Old Navy flip flops on and then of course my waterproof Steve Madden bag. And that is it for today. All right, running late for dinner, so we're gonna make this quick. This is a two piece by Lulu's that I actually bought on Poshmark. It ties in the front, it has high waisted shorts. It's lined, so it's not see through. It zips up the back here. It's a size medium and I paired it with my Target fringe bag, my drop circle earrings that I actually sell in my boutique, and my guest cork wedge heels. So this will be day four dinner outfit. So I just want to make a really quick video. Um, just got back from the pool and this is what I wore. Bathing suit top is from Target. It's probably still for sale there. Um, just got it. And I, pa I repaired it with these Fashion Nova high waisted shorts. Just love like the retro kind of look that this has. And then I just put that with my Steve Madden bag. Okay, so I'm back with day five nighttime outfit. During the day I wore a bathing suit most of the time, so um, didn't worry about that. This is a lace-up bell sleeve two-piece. It's really lightweight, perfect for cruises and vacations. Um, so it laces up here and you can tighten it and loosen it as much as you want. Let me try to give you a full view here. In the front, it splits like this, and I'm just wearing my Guess Wedge heels and target earrings and this is partially lined and fully lined on the top and then lined to or sorry lined on the top and then lined to here on the skirt so it's not see-through and then I'm just wearing my target fringe bag okay so it's day six which means I need to get out there and have some fun so I'm skipping dinner and I'm going straight to the fun tonight I am wearing just something really casual. I'm just wearing a Fashion Nova button-up top. I got a size large so I could tie it up here. It's really lightweight and has this really pretty tropical print. I'm pairing it with the Express High Rise Shorty in a size 6 and American Eagle sandals. So really simple, really quick. I'm gonna go out there and try to have some fun. Alright guys, this is day 7. I'm being kind of lazy and repurposing an outfit or really even just re-wearing an outfit. So this is day one's outfit with a long duster lightweight cardigan over it. Um, I'm about to go and meet friends on the deck. It's going to be a little chilly so I thought this sweater would be perfect for that. And then it's going to be off to dinner after that. So if you miss this outfit, go back and rewind to day one and you will hear all the details. So that is it. Day seven. All right, guys. I think this is what they call the outro. Like I said, it's still my first time doing anything like this. So I just wanted to see if there's anything I could improve upon, which I know there is, or anything else you would like to see. Any other things about cruises or daily wear, that kind of thing. I think it might be fun to do some more videos. Um, so yeah, any ideas are much appreciated. Um, but yeah, if you found this content helpful in any way, just like it below. And yeah, I think that's it. Thanks for watching.